Welcome to antihacker.info video section. Uh, this video is going to be covering a nice uh, <coughs> wireless security appliance or software called AirSnare. Uh, basically it's like an intrusion detection software that you can have running on your computer to allow you to monitor your wire wireless access point or wireless network. Um, to find it, it's got a crazy address. It looks like it's hosted off of a Comcast home account, so it's http colon slash slash home dot comcast dot net slash percentage seven e j a y dot d e b o e r slash air snare slash index html. To make it easier on you and the fact that I had a hard time even pulling up too much information on Google on it, I've added a link on the antihacker.info website under my links page. Right here I have a link for AirSnare. And just as a uh, FYI on antihacker.info, the links is at the bottom corner. Again, I try not to spam my users too much, so I did put it back to the bottom corner but there is a links page on my website and if you have a website of your own or your webmaster and it's computer security or computer help related uh, it's a good possibility I would I will trade links with you if you'd like anyway let's move into the product now that you know the website and where to download it there is a user's guide that will explain it to you and give you all the information you need to know and explain how to set everything up there's a setup that walks you through on how to set it up there's a forums for support, an FAQ, download section, supported equipment, and of course a donate button. Again, a lot of people that make this free software out there for you, they do incur expenses. And it always helps them to develop more software. So I recommend anybody out there offering you software that has a donate button. If you're able to, do it. Go ahead and donate a little bit to them. Anyway, let's go ahead and move into the product. Air Snare. So I'm going to go down here and I'm going to launch it. And once I launch it, you can see where I already have friendlies added here. But I go ahead and I start. And all it's doing is it's listening on my network adapter. And it's got different options in here. Um, you can scan Mac, Mac traffic, TCP traffic, UDP traffic, play a wave alert sound when something happens, have it send you an email. And under options, you can go in and you can actually start setting up more information, the message it sends. Um, all the different scans it's doing, air mail, air horn, tracking. Under tracking, we're going to use uh, air snares tracking. You can actually have a plug-in so it works with Etherreal. Wireless access detected. Um, wireless access as you can detected. see, I'm picking up stuff now, and it's telling me that there's wireless access. And what I would be doing at this point, what I would decide if these are friendlies or not and it's going to record all the information and traffic they're doing. If I know it's something I trust, I'll right click and I'll add to my trusted list. Uh, in this case, these are both trusted devices off of this network. And what it does is it's not worried about those. You can acknowledge alarms, you can clear the alarms, and you can also uh, you can write the log, you can clear the watch log, this is going to give you information on what's happening in your network, destination, source address, uh, destination IP. Just give you an idea of what and where and how it's working. you got DHP requests you can look at. You can also look at the air horn window, and this is kind of what would be sent for your computer. And then you would send it, and it just basically explains the network usage and whatnot. Under your help file, you have your, your about, your donate, and a link to the forums. Again, this is good software to have, especially if you have an open access point. You just start it, let it run, and it's going to let you know who, where, and why, and kind of what's been happening on your wireless access point. Another kind of cool thing is, is uh, if somebody goes on there and starts ARP spoofing, or poisoning your uh, wireless network, you're going to see it here, and it's going to warn you ahead of time, because you're going to see the traffic and the fact that there's multiple NICs and whatnot. So again, it's pretty nice software. It doesn't cost you nothing. When you exit, it actually minimizes this down here so it's still running. All you have to do is go to restore. But again, it's highly recommended. It doesn't cost anything. It's just something else to play with, but it's a pretty decent little intrusion detection appliance or plugin or network or software, however you want to call it, that will run uh, on Windows again, which is really helpful. And it monitors your wireless access.
it can wire, uh, monitor really any access. It doesn't have to be wireless. If you plugged it into a wired network, it would monitor that. Only problem is if it's a larger LAN, you're going to have to make a lot of people either friendly or unfriendly. But it is a good way to watch your network, and it kind of lets you know when new things, are, new computers are seen, uh, when they're asking for DHCP addresses and stuff like that. It's a good troubleshooting technique, too, if uh, you want to see kind of what kind of DHCP requests are going on in your network and you're not real comfortable with using Etherreal, you could even use this program to do that. Well, thank you for joining us for Antihacker.info video on AirSnare. For more information or anything else, feel free to email me. It's slimjim100 at anti-hacker.info or you can find my contact, my IM information for MSN Yahoo and others on antihacker.info under the contacts page. Have a good one.